In 2004, eight former communist countries joined the European Union. I warned them then they were joining a club that would resemble, as the years went by, the club, namely the Soviet Union, that they just left. I am so pleased that Viktor Orban, the boss man in Hungary, now agrees with me. És azért akadtunk meg a torkán, azért tört belénk a foga, mert ragaszkodtunk nemzeti eszméinkhez, hagyjuk el most, hogy a mi közös otthonunkat, az Európai Uniót modern kori birodalommá alakítsák. Nem akarjuk, hogy a szabad Európai Nemzetek Szövetsége helyére egy Európai Egyesült Államokat léptessenek. Watch this. From Hungary, we have Mr. Kovacs. He'll take on taxation. For many years, a communist apparatchik, a friend of Mr. Kedar, the dictator there, and an outspoken opponent of the values that we hold dear in the West. His new empire will produce <laughs> taxation policy, and he'll look after the customs union from Cork across to Vilnius. Are the EPP and British Conservatives really going to vote for that? And the Thank moral, you. Thank and you. The moral of the story is they had learnt nothing from history. Thank Members you, of the European Mr. Parliament, President. Before you give this commission power, remember, remember Thank that you, 60 Mr. years President. ago, an iron curtain came down on Europe. Thank you, that now, Mr. President. With this commission, there is an economic iron fist, yeah. and it's being felt in Greece today. You're going to meet lots of communists over the next six months, including the boss of the Commission here, old Barroso, who was an advocate of Chairman Mao. You will see centralised economic planning and control, and above all what you'll see is the desire to impose a political union upon the peoples of Europe without their consent. Wake up, Mr Orban. Look how they're trying to bully you this morning. They're trying to tell you how to run your own country. Tell them where to go. Stand up and fight for democracy once again. This European Union is the new communism. It is power without limits. It is creating a tide of human misery, and the sooner it is swept away, the better.